Unit 8. 3. Environmental Issues. Read. B. Save the trees. Our environment must be protected. Our planet is not as green as it used to be. Forests are disappearing. Frequently asked questions. KB from Seattle is asking why people cut down trees. To clear land for building cities and highways. To provide land for farming. To make paper, furniture, and building materials. AF from Chicago wants to know if the problem of forest fires is a serious one. Every year, millions of acres of forest land are destroyed in forest fires, which break out all over the world. In the USA alone, about 100,000 forest fires break out per year on average. Most forest fires are caused by man. However, only a small part of this land is replanted. JK from Miami wants to know what forests offer. Habitat. Trees are important to wildlife. Forests are home to millions of species of mammals, birds, insects, and plants. Oxygen and cleaner air. Trees make the air we breathe cleaner and fresher. They produce oxygen, O2, and absorb carbon dioxide, CO2, smoke, dust, and ozone, which pollute the air. Trees also produce water, and this helps protect the earth from too much heat. Fertile land. Trees keep the land fertile. Where there are trees, the soil can't be blown away by the wind or washed away by rain. Trees help the soil absorb large amounts of water, and in this way, floods are prevented. PL from New Orleans is asking what happens when forests are destroyed. The ecological balance that exists in nature is broken. Animals that depend on trees or on other plants for food leave or die because their natural habitat is destroyed. In this way, lots of species of plants and animals are in danger and may disappear forever. The air isn't as cool or as clean as it used to be. The amount of harmful gases in the atmosphere increases. Carbon dioxide, which cannot be absorbed by trees any longer, causes the Earth's temperature to rise. This is called global warming. A piece of land without trees slowly becomes a desert. Rainwater cannot be absorbed by the soil, so it returns to the oceans and seas. As a result, the land becomes hard and dry and nothing can grow on it. The forests that are left on our planet must be protected or else we will have to face the consequences. New forests should also be planted before it's too late. Action must be taken now.